Welcome to Lockmas Day 2. Only 23 days until Santa. 23 sleeves to go. 23 sleeves till Santa. 23 sleeves till Christmas Day. Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me. Christmas memories. So yes, yeah, so I want to find out what the naughty elves have been up to this morning. What they've been up to overnight this week, Pat? What have they done? At my button. They are all your naughty. They are all your buttons. Mm. Oh, they naughty. Mm. Naughty Buddy and naughty Holly, aren't they? And they look, they've left their packet there, aren't they? They even threw their packet in the bin. So good morning everyone and welcome to Wednesday. How are we all doing today? Um, yes, yeah, so we've just done a school run, which is pretty good. Ben had a really good journey in this one, didn't he? Yeah, he did. He did actually, do you have to be there? He did actually start when we got to Aldi, didn't he? Yeah, so well, it wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad. So I don't know if you think, he thought he was scary and stuff or not, I really don't know. But I put Ben and Maury for him on Stephen's phone. He really enjoyed watching that, bless him. And when his, um, one of his helpers come up, he looked at him, gave him a smile, didn't they? So I hope, fingers crossed, he has a really good day. Um, but while was actually waiting, he actually found a packet of pom bear grits in the back of the car. So he's out there munching on there, bless him. And also, what I thought was so cute was obviously, while I was waiting for all the buses to come in, Sam um, met one of his school friends, didn't he? Yeah. In his class, off the bus. So I waited for her to get off the bus, and they, all, they both walked in together. And I thought that was so, so cute. But, um, Sammy and his friend, they've got a really good relationship anyway, aren't they? Yeah. Really, really good. They call, they call each other their best friends anyway. And being honest with you, even the teachers said they're inseparable at school, aren't they? <laughs> they're always playing together at playtimes and things like that, which is really, really lovely. He's got, he's got us, a little best friend. Obviously, it's a girl. <laughs> but never mind, yeah. Um, at least he's happy, which is one good thing. So, anyway, yes, the first stop of the day is we're off to Sainsbury's because obviously Stephen's got some vouchers. I was hoping we could spend an hour Sainsbury's, but there was nothing there, was they wanted like the DVDs or nothing like that. So, we're popping this that we can get and then popping town because we've got to do some shopping for Santa Claus today. So, yes, the popping up to Sainsbury's was a total waste of time, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, they've got no form of DVD, Blu-ray games like ours. Um, but I thought would be that on being a big, massive superstore that would have done. But apparently, they are facing them all out, which I don't understand why. To be honest with you, because not everything for the brand thinking people have got access to media. Think it's not everything's available online all the time, is it? And streaming and things. Um, but anyway, so soon as there's fifteen pound boxes he's got, he's gonna obviously use and tours and shopping and things like that. Something you didn't want to do because something you want for yourself, really, wasn't it? To buy for yourself. Um, at least you've got things like H and V and things like that. So because he wouldn't believe that wanted to buy himself FIFA 21 because I refused to pay stupid prices for games. Um, anyway, so let's pop into Castle Key, see what we can get. We're going to try and see if we can stop in Banbury all day, aren't we, till school pick-up time. Yeah. Not too quite sure if we will or not. Um, got three hours in the car park and then um, go up to the retail park. So possibly we might be able to. Anyway, yes, I'll just see if I put my mask on and then see what we can find in Castle Key. So, yes, yeah, so we're just in um, Devon's now. Obviously, it's closing down. Everyone flocks in here. Was it up to 40%, 50% off or something? It is, isn't it? So we've got some really good things in there, obviously. It was our three for the price of two, so I don't think these were on the offer. Oh, they look good, don't they? They look really good, though. They look like Xbox things. Got some glasses as well, because I don't know what we do need glasses, to be honest with you, because our glasses are really great from the dishwasher. How much are they, anyway? We've got a price on. Oh, my God, I've got a size of bar of chocolate. That's huge, isn't it? I suppose it's all about the same size you buy we get from Cadbury's. I think it is, isn't it? I'll tell you what's the best in the sandwich this morning, this is going to Cadbury's. And we've got here little, what's that? Oh, that's gin. Rhubarb and ginger gin, pink grapefruit, raspberry and palmer violet. Okay, so you take your phone. Both the I love Ferrero Rocher, it's really do. They're quite expensive actually, what they are normally. This is my favorite, I do love the lid or chocolate. I was like 15, so I've some 40% off as well. Got plenty of chocolate coins. I do you think these are a good idea actually, aren't they? Like the, the jars of sweets and things. 
Oh no, I love those. They're really nice. Yeah. Big, and they're £6.50, yeah. Yeah, that's a good offer. Look, the Star, the Starlink starter set for the PS4. Oh, it's 40 quid. Now down to 6 quid. Oh, it's not the game thing inside, though, is it? It's just a normal thing that has got on here. Um, lots of Toy Story, Domino things. Oh, this is different. Marzin Bar Bar Bubbles, only £5. What's that smell? <laughs> £4. Yeah, so we're just in the works now. These are a good idea, aren't they? Two for £10. Good offer, especially if you've got like youngsters and things like that. I've got some spray up graffiti, got the crocheting, the stones, rocks, things, painted rocks. Also got all the clay things. I've got a little money box down here, some fruity labs. Yeah, tattoo kit. That's what Sam would like. Explosive science, but Sam is. I think we've finished for Sam now, haven't we, really, to be honest with you. I have come in here, actually, so they've got any slinkies, because I looked on Amazon, they haven't got any left. Oh, does it build like that? No, he's got two on two, isn't it? He has, isn't he? And the little pieces, I think I'll actually probably bite them. Yeah, so they've got all the Christmas crafty things, stuff like that, probably for the kids' Christmas Eve box. They're good, aren't they? Make your own pom-pom characters and things like that. Yeah, get some gift labels, I definitely need some of those. And obviously it's an air drying foam clay thing. Obviously you've got to be careful with the small pieces for Ben, because I'm trying to get Ben involved as well. So you just pick some of them up. The festive chalk ball, that's a good idea. Um, what are they, little yayos? This is puzzles some ducks. <laughs> oh, that's quite funny, look, a sprout whoopee cushion. Okay, your own jigsaw. Hey, something like that. So get one of those for Sammy, you'll probably get Sammy enjoys his colouring. Yeah, I can remember when Sam used to love all these books. I think that's where half time books actually come from. Obviously, he doesn't like those anymore. He much before was all these sort of books here. Oh, what's that frozen thing? Oh, well, that's different, isn't it? He'll probably enjoy that. He still loves his frozen. He's got the Lion King and the frozen one there, which he asked for a couple of weeks ago. And he um, hasn't asked anything about it, so we just put it back in this Christmas Eve box for him. What's that, the space, what's that? Space truck. And so, oh, wow, these are really, what's that thing there? What's that? Oh, is that rubber? Oh, I'll probably enjoy that. So I guess I can get him that for his Christmas, take that for his Christmas Eve box. Definitely. Yes, yeah, so I just found this little rainbow spring up right for Ben for his Christmas Eve box. Obviously, I do want the big massive ones, but it's only a pound. They look different actually, don't they? The um, marble run thing. Also, it's only where so possible with Peter to social distance and refrain from things you don't want to touch, which is fair enough. Just looking at them, little fidget rings, but I think they're quite small, so you might actually put them in his mouth, mightn't he? What's that little squishy thing there? Got loads of really good things in here actually this time, so obviously it's good because they actually take my vouchers as well. I might use those. Oh, for him, for who? Yeah. Oh, yeah! Look well, yeah, at that, he probably might enjoy that. You've got yeah, the paintbrush. He likes doing paints and stuff. He uses, yeah, he let him use his fingers. Mm. Let him use his oh. He need a basket, didn't we? So yes, that is Bamber's Christmas tree. It's quite nice, actually, isn't it? Yeah. I'm not sure they have a bigger one normally than normally, because normally we come to switch on some things. Obviously, yeah, it's, but obviously what happens, they haven't got one on there. Um, Mark Spencer's used to be there. Tell it's a blow to the town. This Mark Spencer's going. I know they've got the big one on the retail park, haven't they? I know. Are we going to head there today? Are we going to wait till next week for that one? Yeah, till their next one. So, yeah, obviously, we'll try and get anything done in town. We can. Like I said, that's definitely a blessing they're going. What's that? Huh? You can have a look Friday. You can do it. Obviously, about to come pop and take some in a minute. Um, obviously, having to go in around this way, which is fair enough. I look in Devon's, didn't we, just, just a minute ago? And there isn't much decent in there. And expensive as well. These are the um, lights in the um, shopping centre. They're quite pretty, actually, aren't they? Yeah. Really, really pretty. As you can see, we've got five bags full of stuff. So get down there now, which is good. Don't need to fit from in there, do we? And you're going to calendar club, don't we? Get some calendars and things like that. So off we go. And here's see what there is. There you go. Do you want one of these? <laughs> <laughs>
is that? 23. It's expensive for a bag, darling, isn't it? It is a bag. I know he does. He likes some of the character bags, though. He's not going to get them for his age now. not, is he? So anyways, yes, obviously we're shopping for Christmas or for Ben's birthday. Let's find this little hoodie. It's quite thin. It's not too bad for £10, actually. Does it look like that in there? Is it going to go in there? Stick it in. The bags in your moan. I'm not moaning. Hey, that's where you come for, actually, because you actually you carry them all for me. And you get... And then we'll got around here as well. Um, that little T-shirt. Because they've got, they got your bottoms here. Actually, they're not bad, actually, either, haven't you, they? There you go, six ninety nine. There you go. I've been actually flair for I've got some of them for him as well. And I'll go with this top. Not bad actually, you can see eighty percent off. Original price was on thirty quid now, just six from seven pounds. But yeah. Go around there, they've got around here. Um oh, that's nice, like that, huh? It's expensive, Lexi's like, looks forty two pound each or two for sixty four. Isn't it? Well we've got a good, good, good couple of good offers in there for him anyway. There you go. That's quite a nice bag. I like that one. That's quite, isn't it? What do you think care Sam as long as he's got a bag? There you go. That's right, Nadalin, for 13 quid. I should get that one. That's a bit no, better for him. Right. Yeah, I like that one for. Or should I get him a Liverpool bag for £10? <laughs> he's not that into football, though, is he? He's been us, yeah. They are sweat, actually, aren't they? Those ones are. T shirts up here. I think it was right for those. But it was right for t shirts, wasn't it? It was just jogging bottoms and hoodies. Because obviously, where it's been laying on the floor is jogging bottoms have got um, holes in the knees. Like that top. That's quite nice, actually. Real good price, that one as well. Stephen's just looking for trainers. Are you looking for, for yourself? Are you looking for, um, for Sammy? Looking for you because you need some, don't you? So, but look at the price of these. They're 85 quid. If my trainers are expensive, well, I can just pay for 85 quid on a pair of trainers. I know some people should. Yes, we just got these for Ben, aren't we? These they're for the size 14 big boots. Obviously, they're the ideal for him because he can't keep them off. Well, I kick them off. And also, they've got their big, nice big heel. Not heel, but I mean, like the tre tread on the bottom. So, if it does get icy and stuff like that, at least he wants to pay for yeah, those. It was a successful trip actually shopping around Bamford this start this morning, wasn't it? It started off a bit. I didn't want to do this, and then it suddenly got into the full swing of it. We did actually, but I'll tell you the truth, we've actually made a dent in it. I think practically, almost practically finished out, which is good. We made a dent in the bank account. <laughs> we have unfortunately but that's this time of the year is it so we were saving up for it anyway wasn't we so it yeah. wasn't too bad so yeah so obviously you managed to get all of Ben's birthday presents sorted out as well which is good that's because my hair look it's gone really messy where I have where I just took my hat off um uh, but yeah so obviously like I said finished my mum's now just got to get one more thing for my dad a couple more things for my sister and um I think we're done being on so have not we which is pretty good. Um, believe it or not, the town wasn't that busy. I thought because all the shops are probably open, it would be manic and never it really wasn't. Um, it was obviously I've just heading off to the retail park now, see what's the KFC because I am hungry as well. To be you. We got back to the car with about five minutes to spare for the ticket, which that is going to prove to you we've actually um, done a lot of shopping as well. So, if we spend the next couple of hours around here, exactly. Yes, yeah, so obviously, we're going to get some few snacks and pieces, obviously, for the kids who want to come home from school. It just wasn't worth going home now and going back in, was it really? How much parking time have you got here? I don't think, I think it's unlimited actually to be honest with you. So anyway, what we'll do is we'll pop in. We'll walk over to Tesco's, we've got time. Oh, well, yeah, we'll have time as well. Um, yeah. So anyway, yeah, so obviously I think we might pop in KFC car park, do it from there, I might as well. And then I'm leaving the car again, I'll just park up. Just park up and we'll go from there. Obviously, yeah, we need to, oh yeah, one more thing, we need to go into Tuesday and get some of some trainers as well, so. I've got tomato sauce around my mouth. Tell you what, guys, I put absolutely stuff. This went into Pizza Hut. Um, we were going to KFC, but there wasn't let her know I'm dining for some reason, was they? No. I really don't know why. But anyway, we going to Pizza Hut. Um, because it's on the same retail park anyway. It was only letting people dine in. She goes, yes, as long as you're from the same household and you do the track and trace app thing, wasn't it? You scan the QR card as that you were in. Anyway, so we had the buffet. I feel absolutely stuffed. Do you feel stuffed? Mm. I do. Um, I've had the pizza. But obviously, they're not doing... It's a limited section, isn't it, what they're doing? Yeah. And obviously, you have to order it through the app on the phone and stuff like that. But it was so much easier. Um, straight to your table, things like that. So, I tell you what, I don't want much for tea tonight after having that pizza with the pasta and the salad and the chips and things like that. So, anyway, yes, yeah, so just outside Poundland now. We've got to go in here and get the kids some snacks um, before they, well, before they wake up later on, because I know they'll be hungry. So, 
And also Tim just said about having a look for Christmas trees. Yeah, you can those crackers for two pounds. They're quite nice, aren't they? What what they got in the back? What they got in the back? Puzzle bookmark book calculator or origami and fun book. Yeah, get them. They're both for two pounds, are they actually? Yeah. So just looking at the Christmas jumpers. I've, I've still got mine actually. Anyway, I think it should be fine. So yeah, so this. So they got their snacks. Batteries are right for for Defna. And we've also put aside a couple of face masks, haven't we? Bless him. Because one of you's had it needs washing and stuff like that. Um, all right for this sort of stuff anyway. I need some shampoo, I think. See what they've got. What's this one? Oh, I've got some other shampoo. I like this. No, I've got one I normally have actually. Um. No, normally I've did the one for the for the blonde hair. I can't seem to find it, so I've got I've got enough for now anyway. So yeah, so we're just waiting at school now for the boys, aren't we? Um, all shopping for Father Christmas is all done, completed now, which is really really great. Um, only thing is Father Christmas has obviously asked us to wrap it up for him first, haven't we? Mm. So I thought we could spend the next couple of days wrapping it all up. Um, do need to go to Primark next week and get a couple more bits for him. So, but we'll leave that till next Wednesday, aren't we? Now, yeah, yeah, stuff like that. Can't believe we've actually spent the whole day in Banbury, but it's been really, really, really good. Really enjoyed it, haven't you? Yeah, top it off now. We've been having a good day now, but I'm not expecting too much to be honest with you from Ben. So, yeah, some really good days yesterday. So, anyway, yes, yeah, so I think we got back up to school just in time because heavens have actually started to tip. Down with rain, so boys. Well, so when we're here, they've got another the 15 minutes to like, come out of school and um, find out when they get in what sort of days they had. So, yes, yeah, you can see the boys are home from school, obviously, back from the school run. Um, Sam, you look tired, sweetie. Are you tired? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was you went to bed late last night for some reason. I really don't know why. Um, yeah, Ben's had a perfect drain your home again, which is really, really lovely. Didn't you see that? Obviously, it's at the mum in the back. Um, you did give, you did give my hands a few times. Sammy, you turn that down please, sorry, but too loud. Are you enjoyed looking when we're driving through the, from the house and states up by school. You enjoyed looking at all the Christmas slides, didn't you, my darling? Um, school said he was a bit more responsive today. He has been all week actually. They said they've noticed a difference this week, which is great. So I don't know if it's um, see us taking him to school in the mornings. I really don't know, but we've um. He's started them off from chamomile tea and he's also having some multivitamin tablets that's supposed to be good for mental health. So I don't know if it's which of that or whether it's just Ben being happy again, which is really lovely to see. Anyway, apparently this afternoon he's been playing with the guitar. He loves the guitar. So we might see if we can buy you a cheap one if we get like a little local aid or something like that. Hey, darling? And Sammy's had a really good day as well, aren't you, sweetheart? Yeah. What are you doing? You start getting the Christmas decorations out of school or something, aren't you? Yeah. It's really, really draining that. So... Hey, well, yeah, so it feels good to be home, actually, because, like I said, it's half past four. We got home at quarter past four, so we stopped all day in Banbury. So, mm -hmm. let's make a cup of tea. What do you want for your tea, my darling? Dinosaurs. You want some dinosaurs? Yeah, because my and dad didn't want no tea. Mm -hmm. We had a nice yummy pizza from Pizza Hut that really mm -hmm. full wound me up. Do you want one of your fish cakes, my darling, for your tea? Mm -hmm. And you see, bless him, he's um, <coughs> enjoying he's watching Sammy play on his game. Well then guys, yeah, I have to say today has been a really, 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 really lovely day. Yeah, I really have, really have enjoyed today. It's been one of those days that we haven't had for a long time. And it's been nice actually, been nice, been shopping with you. It has been nice actually, isn't it? And like the bank account took a bit of a hit. Oh, doesn't everyone's bank account this time of year take a hit? I oh, know. Well, anyway, okay. it was nice to have a meal together as well, wasn't it? Tell you what, um, I know it was obviously the first time being to Pizza Hut this year. Is it this year? Yeah, first time for ages. I think it is actually. And also, we had the birthday. I didn't vlog it obviously. Because... Wasn't gonna go into Pizza Hut. We wanted to go into KFC, but they kept saying, "Oh, you're not allowed to eat in. You're not allowed to eat in." When uh, we very well know in the Tier Two area. You, you can. can you can dine in as as, to... as table dining. Yeah, so but anyway, because obviously <coughs> you know, so the first time we done pizza, pizza Hut, like I said, the um pre, the um buffet dining thing for a while. Mm. I tell you what, it was nice because I know it took a while to get organised. It we're organised, we're ordering and paying on the app and stuff like that. But give them credit, when it come out to us, it was really really hot. I know when we done like the um buffet before in the past, it could be quite cold. Yeah. And it's actually nice eating a nice hot piece of pizza. 
a nice hot bit of pasta. And of course, after our second picture, she said, oh, do you want to put some more putting in? No, it's okay, folks. Two bits is enough. Yeah, I have my limits, guys. Don't, you've got to have your limits. After two of those small round pieces, I tell you, that, that was plenty for me. I can't, is, I can't believe some people can eat more than that. It's crazy. The only thing is, we only got one bit of pasta each, didn't we? I yeah. thought the pasta might have been on the limited as well, but it was still nice day. I still really, really enjoyed it. Yeah, it was a nice day out, wasn't it? It was. As it was, as it was, as it was getting on for um, lunch time, stuff like that, we noticed Bambi was getting busy, wasn't it? Especially the retail park. And as we drove past that way from with the kids, it was packed in it because it was totally crazy in there. Oh. Yeah, and um, Ben's had a quite a good day. The only thing is, again, it's just getting him from the classroom to the vehicle in the evenings, which has basically been the only problem this week in theory, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, no, he has. It's obviously he has laid on the floor and things like that. But this has been told to kiss and things like that sort of thing, which is pretty good actually, because not being nasty. Obviously, I went in the classroom first to begin with tonight, and I said to him, "Come Ben, let's go home. You got us straight away, didn't you? Absolutely fine." So. Yeah. Just like that, guys, yeah. So, just proves a point that the, uh, the transport may have been the problem after all, but next week it's got to go back to normal because I'm back to work. So. Things, we don't know if it's a transport or not for definite because don't forget, I've started on off on these um, camera TS plays for good for anxiety, isn't it? Yeah. And also, he's having all these multivitamin things which are good for mental health. He's having those, so maybe they're helping. Just don't know, but as I said, the testing part will be next week, I think. I hate to say it, but I've quite enjoyed doing it this week, really. And uh, I think school's basically glad that, you know, it's been more of a settled week for everyone this week. They have, even the school said it's more settled. <coughs> Not only that, so it is enjoyed us, us taking him to school. I'd pick him up in the evenings and lesson as well, which is pretty good, so. Yeah. Tell you, the only way I can do that is become a full-time YouTuber, but we're nowhere near those figures yet. No way, no way. I tell you, it'd be nice, nice to really, you know, look after Ben and take him in and, in and out every day. And um, he does really, really correspond better for me than what he does for anyone, doesn't he? He does because um, even tonight coming back here, obviously he had his juice and he had like a few snacks and stuff and I didn't even, didn't even get any snacks today, he just had his drink. Perfect trip home tonight, it absolutely was. fine, no head banging, nothing. I didn't even need to distract him on YouTube, did I? I had, with everyone, he was quite happy, I said, driving down, looking out the window, looking at all the lights and things like that, so. Yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect week, I tell you, it's been... Don't speak just too one, soon. Yeah, don't speak too soon. Tomorrow will probably be like... Well, know, tomorrow Friday to hell, go, yeah. Hell, hell freeze over tomorrow or something like that. But tomorrow Friday to go, yeah. <laughs> but hopefully... Yeah. Yeah, well, it's been a good start to the half a week, shall we say. Yeah. Yep, yeah, uh, tomorrow, guys, school run again in the morning and then it's back here then just to do a bit of housework. Not really much tomorrow. I think we've done enough today, don't we, Cheryl? I think we've done loads. <laughs> so, like I said, we're practically finished. I've just got the last couple of bits and pieces, haven't we? So there's yeah. nothing, nothing major or nothing like that. So we're wrapping it all up. That's the problem now. Yeah. So then, guys, thanks for joining us today. And uh, as always, please, please, please hit that subscribe button. Get us to 5K and we'll open that P.O. box. Simple as that. So 5K, P.O. box. So, Cheryl. Yes. Anyway, so like button, dislike if you wish, and comment down below as always, and we'll see you tomorrow for Thursday. Peace bye, guys. Bye. bye. bye.